Good morning, my name is Christy Rutledge and I'm running for your 10th grade class president. Leadership has always been an important quality to me and one that I wish to put to good use in the 2023-2024 school year. I would love to lead our class to success through allowing everyone's opinions to be expressed. Not only do I want to engage with the student body, I also want to allow our class to have a prominent voice in the choices and progressive changes made here at PrEP. While I could promise ice cream or something fun every day, I wouldn't be able to promise no disappointment with the outcome. I won't make any promises that I can't keep. However, what I can promise is that I would work to the best of my ability in my role as 10th grade class president to ensure that our student council is strengthened and respected and takes into account sophomores' wants and needs. When asked, most people would probably say that the most important qualities in a leader are power and influence. These traits are certainly important for leaders in their various roles, but I believe one of the most significant elements in a leader is trust. Trustworthiness and truthfulness enable a leader to effectively use the power and influence that naturally comes with that position. I would build trust with students and the administration by always being truthful. My willingness to listen and learn from others with a basis of truth and respect would enable me to be an effective leader for our class. All of this being said, I would greatly appreciate your vote for me as sophomore class president. Hello, my name is Knox Davidson. From the first day I arrived at PrEP, I knew I wanted to become more involved. Now, I consistently spend time in leadership roles, such as being a junior high cheerleader and a 2023 pacer. I'm also currently chaplain of the National Junior Honor Society, and I'm involved in many clubs here at PrEP, so I can contribute to the school by trying to make it a better place than it already is. It probably won't surprise you that I've decided to run for vice president of our class. As student council vice president of the upcoming sophomore class, I will strive to make improvements throughout the school for every student here at PrEP by utilizing skills such as leadership, teamwork, communication, and organization. The student council works side by side with the administration and the student body to ensure that every school event is successful. As vice president, I will ensure that your sophomore year is memorable. I've enjoyed the opportunities to be a part of so many different clubs and organizations here. So today, I'm asking for your vote for vice president. Should you elect me, I will listen to your concerns and be dedicated to representing and being a voice for the upcoming sophomore class. Thank you. Good morning. As most of you know, my name is Ann Melton Hewitt and I'm humbly asking for your vote to be the next sophomore class president. While well, giving my speech, I could just give out a bunch of empty promises that you obviously would know I wouldn't be able to keep. So instead, I'm here to show you why I think I would be a great person to represent our class as our president. To me, being the class president requires many different qualities and leadership skills. A leader is someone who not only can rise to the occasion, but someone who can work with the entire student body on behalf of the sophomore class. I feel like I can best represent our class as I'm involved in many different activities and clubs here at PrEP where I hold leadership positions, which allows me to see every aspect of our school. Because of this, I would be able to represent you and better understand what matters to you most whether it was for the academics, the arts, or the athletics. Lastly, I would like to wish the best of luck to Christy and Sam, because I know that either one of them would do an amazing job as president. Although, I do think that it's time for a new era of leadership. Good morning, as most of you know, my name is Brooklyn Johnson, and I'm running to be your next 10th grade vice president. For the past years, I've been on student council serving on leadership positions learning the reps to better represent our class. Over the past few years, I have loved participating in student-led events, supporting the arts and musicals, and participating in service opportunities. Lastly, I would like to wish good luck to Knox and Ridge, but I believe I have what it takes to understand the needs of our class and represent them to the student body. Remember, if you vote for Brooklyn Johnson, your needs come first. Consider it handled, Olivia Pope. Good morning, everybody. My name is Sam Sherman. I've truly enjoyed being your class president this year, and it would be a privilege and an honor to serve you again next year. This year was our first year being high schoolers, so I tried to make sure it was as memorable as possible. Student council worked hard to make sure the ninth grade was included in all high school activities from homecoming and winter formal to being a part of student sections and sporting events. 
I would like to see everybody attending every possible student event and supporting one another, whether it's show choir, sports, or an art show. It's important to support our peers as much as we can. I've enjoyed thoroughly working with Ms. Hepner and serving as a voice for our grade. It's very important to me to hear from you, know your ideas, and try to make these ideas happen. I want the class of 2026 to have the best high school experience that we can. Thank you for listening. Please vote Sam Sherman for class president and go probe. Hi, my name is Ridge Gamlin and I'm running for your sophomore class vice president. I've had a great first year at prep and I'm grateful to be part of this class and for all the opportunities that come with it. I want the privilege to be able to serve our class and I'm excited by the opportunity. I'm willing to work hard to help make the 10th grade class the best it can be and make a difference in our school. If elected, I'll take this position seriously and be honored with the opportunity to serve y'all.